Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be reacting to Hamilton, Cabinet Battle number one. This is the live Broadway musical we're going to be reacting to first and then after that we're going to check out the animatic version which I'm looking forward to. So without further ado, let's put it on full screen, make sure the volume is up, it is, and off we go. The issue on the table! Secretary Hamilton's plan to assume state debt and establish a national bank. Secretary Jefferson, you have the floor, sir. Life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. We fought for these ideals, we shouldn't settle for less. These are wise words, enterprising men quote them. Don't act surprised, you guys, cause I wrote them. Ow, but Hamilton forgets. His plan would have the government assume state's debt. Now place your bets as to who that benefits. The very seat of government where Hamilton sits. Not true. Oh, if the shoe fits, wear it. If New York's in debt, why should Virginia bear it? Uh, our debts are paid, I'm afraid. Don't tax the South, cause we got it made in the shade. In Virginia, we plant seeds in the ground. We create. You just want to move our money around. This financial plan is an outrageous demand, and it's too many damn pages for any man to understand. Stand with me in the land of the free. Pray to God we never see Hamilton's candidacy. Look, when Britain taxed our tea, we got frisky. Imagine what gonna happen when you try to tax our whiskey. Thank you, Secretary Jefferson. <laughs> Hmm. Secretary Hamilton, your response. Thomas, that was a real nice declaration. Welcome to the present. We're running a real nation. Would you like to join us? We're staying mellow, doing whatever the hell it is you do in Monticello. <laughs> if we assume the debts, the union gets a new line of credit, a financial diuretic, how do you not get it? If we're regressive and competitive, the union gets a boost. You'd rather give it a sedative? A civics lesson from a slaver. Hey, neighbor, your debts are paid because you don't pay for labor. We plant seeds in the South. We create. You keep ranting. We know who's really doing the planting. <laughs> and another thing, Mr. Age of Enlightenment, don't lecture me about the war. You didn't fight in it. You think I'm frightened of you, man? We almost died in the trench while you were off getting high with the French. Yeah. Thomas Jefferson always hesitant with the president. <laughs> Redison, there is in a plan he hasn't jettisoned. Madison, you mad as a Haddison. Take your medicine. Damn, you in worse shape than the national debt is in. Sitting there useless as two shits. Hey, turn around, bend over. I'll show you where my shoe fits. Excuse me. <laughs> Madison Jefferson, take a walk. Hamilton, take a walk. <laughs> We're gonna reconvene after a brief recess. <laughs> Hamilton, sir, a word. You don't have the votes. You don't have the votes. <laughs> You're gonna need congressional approval and you don't have the votes. Such a blunder, sometimes it makes me wonder why I even bring the thunder. Why he even brings the thunder? Oh, that was good. It's good to be listening to Hamilton again. Can you imagine if that's how um, all like government politics was handled in a rap battle? <laughs> oh, I really enjoyed that. I completely forgot that he's back. I love the outfit. There's something about it. It's just so cool. Um, are they kind of like contrasting colors? That's really cool. Um, yeah, that was really good. I really enjoyed that. The um, he really, really kind of put it to him. I suppose I, I don't really know how to uh, to express what I'm saying. Um, that was really good, really clever back and forth. Um, I definitely think Hamilton won that out of the two. Um, I loved the rhythm of the songs. I loved the comedy that was in there. That was so good. I really enjoyed. <laughs> Uh, this guy when he like when Hamilton drops like the slave line and you just see him like look over his shoulder like yeah I really enjoyed that that was really good right let's move on to the uh the animatic by the way please excuse me whilst I'm getting back into doing YouTube and stuff if I'm not uh, very good at expressing myself as, as maybe I was in previous videos um I've had a little bit of a break but I'm back now so uh yeah Let's jump right into it. So this is the animatic. This is uh, longer, so I assume this has more of the song in that wasn't included in the uh, recording of that live version. Right, let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, 
You could have been anywhere in the world tonight, but you're here with us in New York City. Are you ready for a cabinet meeting, huh? The issue on the table. Secretary Hamilton's plan to assume state debt and establish a national bank. Secretary Jefferson, you have the floor, sir. Life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. We fought for these ideals, we shouldn't settle for less. These are wise words, enterprising men quote them. Don't act surprised, you guys, cause I wrote them. Ow, but Hamilton forgets. His plan would have the government assume state debt. Now place your bets as to who that benefits. The very seat of government where Hamilton sits. Not true. Oh, if the shoe fits, wear it. If New York's in debt, why should Virginia bear it? Uh, our debts are paid, I'm afraid. Don't tax the South, cause we got it made in the shade. In Virginia, we plant seeds in the ground. We create, you just want to move our money around. This financial plan is an outrageous demand, and it's too many damn pages for any man to understand. Stand with me in the land of the free. Pray to God we never see Hamilton's candidacy. Look, when Britain taxed our tea, we got frisky. Imagine what gonna happen when you try to tax our whiskey. You know, that's actually a really good point. Um, this must have been an extremely polarizing um, idea from Hamilton. The fact that he's wanting to kind of share the share the debt effectively and kind of, you know, like move the money around and things like that. Um, I've never really kind of thought about that, but it must have been so polarizing, like such a bold thing to try and convince the government to agree to. Thank you, Secretary Jefferson. Secretary Hamilton, your response. Thomas, that was a real nice declaration. Welcome to the present, we're running a real nation. Would you like to join us? Or staying mellow, doing whatever the hell it is you doing, Monticello. If we assume the debts, the union gets a new line of credit, a financial diuretic, how do you not get it? If we're aggressive and competitive, the union gets a boost. You'd rather give it a sedative? A civics lesson from a slave or hey neighbor. Your debts are paid because you don't pay for labor. We plant seeds in the south. We create and keep ranting. We know who's really doing the planting. And another That's a deep burn. The age of enlightenment. Don't lecture me about the war. You didn't fight in it. You think I'm frightened of you, man? We almost died in the trench. Well, you were off getting high with the French. Thomas Jefferson always hesitant with the president. Medicine. There isn't a plan he doesn't jettison. Madison, you mad as a habit, so take your medicine. Damn, you in worse shape than the national debt is in. Sitting there useless as two shits. Hey, turn around, bend over. I'll show you where my shoe fits. Excuse me. Madison, Jefferson, take a walk. Hamilton, take a walk. We're going to reconvene after a brief recess. Hamilton, sir, a word. You don't have the votes. You don't have the votes. <laughs> You're gonna need congressional approval and you don't have the votes. Such a blunder, sometimes it makes me wonder why I even bring the thunder. Why he even brings the thunder? You wanna pull yourself together? I'm sorry, these Virginians are birds of a feather. Young man, I'm from Virginia, so watch your mouth. So we let Congress get held hostage by the South? need the votes. No, we need bold strokes. We need this no, plan. No, you need to convince more folks. Well, James Madison won't talk to me. That's a non-starter. Ah. Winning was easy, young man. Governing's hard. They're being intransigent. You have to find a compromise. But they don't have a plan. They just hate mine. Convince them otherwise. And what happens if I don't get congressional approval? I imagine they'll call for your removal. Sir, figure it out, Alexander. That's an order from your commander. That was great. I really loved the quote at the end there that wasn't on the original one, where it's like, um, winning is easy, young young man or young men governing is harder, which is obviously a callback to an earlier, um, the earlier songs. Um, yeah, that, that was really good. I really enjoyed that. I loved the beat to it. I loved its tempo. I loved the back and forth kind of rap style it reminds me very much of um epic rap battles of history which i haven't seen in years but those are really good videos um let me know if you want me to check out some of those actually i'm about to do some reactions to some of those because those are great it's kind of like this where it's like a back and forth battle basically but rapping um 
That was great. Who is, by the way, please excuse my ignorance again. Um, it's been a while since I've like gone through this, so I may just be forgetting. Um, the guy with Jefferson, what, what's his name? He was coughing on the um, on this one. Him. He was coughing. Is he ill? Um, is that something that's part of the actual performance, or was he just was the actor here ill at the time? And he kind of just worked it into the the performance. Um, or is that something that I'd find out later? Um, if it's not, I, I, yeah, I'm really interested to find out if that's just something that came of the live performance um, or if that particular character is sick for some reason. Um, yeah, let me know. That was great. I really enjoyed that. Um, the cinematic was really good as well, so um, give that a thumbs up. And it looks like... Um, yeah, there's a few people that are doing the animatics here, so um, I'll be switching between people this time rather than just uh, sticking to one person. So uh, yeah, if you have any suggestions, let me know. I hope you enjoyed. I really enjoyed. I'm glad to be back, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.